All right, you've seen her on this screen. She's here in the flesh. It's time to create with Quimby, our DIY queen. Shannon Quimby is showing us how to make these elevated stacked painted plant pots that you see on your screen right now. This could be an elegant addition to your backyard space. Also, how cool Shannon's in studio, which we have not been able to do for the longest time. It's great to have you here in person. I Thanks know. for coming in. I am so fired up. Yeah. This is so this great. Is this is awesome. I yeah. mean, don't get me wrong. When we have you on this screen, it's great. But this is this is awesome to have you in. I and know. Uh, now you can actually put us Can't to work a little beat. bit today. Yeah. Yeah, which, yeah. yeah, which you know I'm gonna do. Oh yeah, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> and understandably so. I mean, we got the, we got the aprons on. We've got some we yep. got some we got some gloves here. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. So what exactly are we working on? Well, well, you know, we're going to kind of zazz up, you know, boring flower pots. Okay. okay? And um, and so I made some over here. And it's Great. really simple, you guys. So when I'm talking through the steps, you get to do the, like, the fun last bit part of it. Perfect. Okay? Yes. And um, I, I'm using Miller Paints. It's part of their new um, color line. It's the Northwest color line. It Ooh. really reflects the colors of the Pacific Northwest. Mm -hmm. And this one's yeah. called In the Dark. So you two, you start painting. Okay. okay. You got that one. Okay. You got this one. So we've always, so every once in a while, say this is Travis this. proof, but now we actually are putting that to the test. All we'll see if it's actually <laughs> Travis proof now. <laughs> Just hold it up and paint. Okay. 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 That I think I can handle. Got that? I can one, handle that. One step. Yeah. And right. I have the drop cloth, guys. So, okay. so we, we're, we're good here. We don't care yeah, about getting yeah. this. Wonderful. Yeah. Wonderful. So th the simple thing is you just, you just need two flower pots. And notice they don't match. Mm -hmm. okay. Right. One on top. And that's the key to this. Travis. So, what do I do? Oh, that's all right. Did I screw it up? Oh, well, you're just. Oh. I'm just going. Go, go for it. Okay. See, this is what I do. Yeah. This is what I do. I just go. I just yeah. go. Okay. I, There's, the DIY police is not going to show up and give you a ticket. <laughs> okay. It's, it's okay. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Your alarms are sounding. Yeah. So um, we've got two different types of pots, too. We have a clay pot, which you can paint right over. Okay. And then below that, it's actually a plastic pot. And so if you do have plastic, you're going to kind of want to sand it. Okay. Because okay. if the paint, if you don't, the paint will literally, you can take a fingernail and just go, Just like rip. peel yeah. it right okay off. Okay, that he's making a big old mess. It's okay. Oh, I mean, there was it's no other right. way this was ever going to happen. Yeah. Yeah. So you want to sand that, rough it up, and then wipe off a little bit of the dust. Okay. 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 So simple, simple. Then the next step is, is you just get some all-purpose glue. Okay. And you just take the bottom of one pot and you put the glue around it. Okay. And then you center it on top of the other. Perfect. And how long do you have to wait for that to dry until it's pretty Well, stable? you know, they say a couple hours, but I let it do it overnight because, okay. see, right, we're manhandling these. Right. right? We're you want to make sure it's really over. secure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Been there, done that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's like, don't like, drop you'll, you'll, you'll learn by trial and error sometimes. Yeah, you know? I dropped it too early. Yeah. <laughs> so then, paint pot everywhere. <laughs> it's right. And so, and then the last step is what you guys are doing. Okay. And the fun, great thing about this project is it's kind of like a two for one. So notice these, I'm gonna move this. I have these over here. And it's really important, you wanna do different shapes mm -hmm. because right. that kind of modernizes them. Yeah. And to paint them all one color, then it, the two become one. And the fun thing is, check this out. So you have this size, like that. I'll move this color over. Okay. Beautiful color, by the way. Um, right this, and you're like, hmm, I know. I'm gonna flip it over and I'm <gasps> oh, gonna do the other one. Oh, look at that, one. a little wow. wow. Right. They're this is this is why you're the DIY queen. So, I, I, this is this is next level. Where's her crown? Oh, oh. you know <laughs> what? We're gonna I'll make wear one. one next. Uh, yeah, <laughs> we will we'll make one. We'll DIY, DIY crown. DIY crown. How about crown. that? Yeah, that's fantastic. But once again, you know these colors are beautiful. You know they harmonize. That's really important to do. So, oh look, but, done. Uh, Emma's uh, did way better at arts and crafts. Done, than I did. done, done. Well, yeah, it's easy. Yeah, absolutely. She's, I did. she's calling you out, Travis. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, yeah. I, uh, th I, I'm I not going to brag. I started by calling him. Yeah, out. yeah. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not going to brag. You guys but are this is a really sim simple idea, though. <laughs> simple. Like, once, once again. Yeah, two coats, you know, mm -hmm. probably two coats. If you paint two, you know, even if it drips, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Right? We're doing it ourselves. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, you exactly. Know, do a design. Yeah, we're you making could... it. It's handmade. It's unique. It's one of a kind. And again, it doesn't have to be this material. Like you're saying, like you can do different materials. Correct. You just have to make sure you sand things off from time to time to make sure the paint doesn't peel. Ex yes, exactly. Yeah. And even if you had like a glossy pot, mm -hmm. and a lot of them, they chip. Right? And uh -huh. then you're like, oh, that's not kind of, doesn't look good anymore. Right? right? Throw on some paint. Make and it work. Brand Just, you new. Can, yeah, so you can, you, can take, you can take stuff you already have. I'm well, so I think thrilled. Good chance if you, if you have a home garden, you already have extra pots like this yep. laying around. Yep. And you can just you and can just so spruce them up. They're so cheap at any hardware store, too. Oh. Like, you can get mm -hmm. for a dollar. Go to your neighbors. I'm sure people have extra ones. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. 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 Buy local, stick with Miller Paint. 
Northwest Color Collection, and you guys are golden. I think it's a great idea. Mm -hmm. And if and if you, for whatever reason, feel like you need to hire uh, myself or Emma, I would go with Emma. Yeah. I'm, I'm at a discounted rate. You get you get. Uh, in, He'll pay much more, you. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Don't come, go, don't come near me with the brush. It's dangerous. Yeah. Oh. Students of all levels. Exactly, exactly. Yes. Beginners to advanced. Shannon, yeah. it's great to have you in studio. It's Thank so you. much fun. This was so great. I love this so much. I'm Look how good to, you did. Yeah, oh. done. Easy peasy. Nailed it. Five Nailed gold it. stars. I, Five gold yeah, stars. Yeah, in the entire time I took this segment. Yep. That's incredible. And, and you're already done. Yep. I'm not, but that was a me problem. Yeah. All right, <laughs> All right Shannon, great to see you. Al gotcha. Always great stuff. Always great stuff. And for a full list of instructions and materials, of course, we'll have that online at coin.com. Be sure to also follow Shannon on Facebook to stay up to date on her latest DIY projects. All right, Emma, will you do the tease?